I got hold of the new Hugo Boss Magnetic. If you want to stay around and watch first impressions, by all means, people, let's do it. Let's smell it together. YouTube, hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to my channel. Hello to my fragrance family. Right, I've just done the first impressions on the new Hugo Boss Magnetic. I thought I pressed record, I didn't. So, when I've finished the video, I've gone back and I hadn't even pressed the record button. This has literally just happened. So this is first impressions, second time round. I've literally just sprayed it, but I'm going to talk to you about this fragrance. I ordered this, I'm a donut. That's all I'm going to say about that, right. I ordered this off of the fragrance shop website. It is a place in the UK. I don't know if they ship worldwide. I really don't know that. I live in the UK, so when I looked at it for samples, this popped up and I got an 8ml sample. I've never ordered a sample from these before. I've ordered fragrances from their website, but never samples. And this is how it's turned up. In a nice little smart box, look. It's a magnetic, so it stays shut. And then look at that. Look how smart that looks. Look, this is an 8ml atomizer. Look. Bam. And there it is. Look how cool that is, look. I'm easily fascinated. I don't know if you've noticed. But anyway, I think that's decent. Um, I think I paid £17 maybe for an 8mm sample. I just wanted to see what it was saying. I was, one of my subscribers was talking to me the other day, like commenting on one of my videos. And he sort of brought it up like, are you going to be reviewing the new... Hugo Boss, or when are you? And I thought, you know what? As he didn't ask me to do this, but he was interested, so I thought I'd order it and I'll try and please the audience. Obviously, I can't order every fragrance. I'm not a millionaire. If I was a millionaire, I would have every fragrance in the world. If I was a millionaire, right, my whole house would just have shelves on the walls and every room would be full of fragrances. It's simple as that. I mean, every every nook and cranny would be full of bowls. So, one little thing at a time, people. So, I've got it. I have just sprayed it, but I'm going to spray it again. Right, there's three notes listed in this. There's Maninka Fruit, Bran, and Black Vanilla Husk. Let me tell you, this opens fruity, it's a little bit dusty, it's a little bit powdery. The vanilla is there, but the vanilla is in the back. This is quite fruity. And this is giving me a sort of cherry bakewell vibe, if that makes sense. Even though there's no cherry in here, the way that Maninka's played out in this... The bran, I believe, is giving it that dusty powderiness. There is, like I say, a vanilla or vanillic tone to the fragrance, but the vanilla's in the back. The, it's fruity dominant at the minute it is anyway. And I'm also getting, even though there's only three notes listed, I'm getting a little bit of a smooth leathery vibe, like way in the back. There is just something there I don't know if it's the way the notes are blended. It's just coming off. Oh, like I sprayed one spray on my hand. And especially on my skin. It, I'm just getting little whiffs of leather. Like really subtle, smooth, quiet leather. Mixed in with that fruitiness and that powderiness. I'm going to tell you straight off the bat. This is definitely not going to be a complex fragrance. 
But I'm telling you something now, this is very, very nice. This is gonna be, I believe, a mass appealing fragrance, easy to wear. If you like fragrances in general, I think you're definitely gonna like this fragrance. I know some people, but I've never met them, but I know some people don't wear fragrances. That's fair enough, each to your own. You do you, and I do me, and you do you. That's fair enough. But I think people in general that wear fragrances are gonna enjoy this fragrance, Magnetic from Hugo Boss. It's just very, very pleasing. And it's a little bit, it's fruity, a bit powdery. It's nice, it really is. I think this is a bit of a playful fragrance. There's nothing serious about it. I think this would be great. The, I, I think you could wear this all year round. I just wouldn't, me personally, I wouldn't wear it on blistering hot days. I would wear it on summer evenings if I was going out to a bar or something to eat. Because when the breeze catches this and it crosses someone's nose path, I'm telling you, they're going to be like a bloodhound. They're going to be going, who smells so goddamn good? Because it is really good smelling. I think it is. But I think this is nice dressed up. If you're going out on the town, if you're going out for a few drinks, if you're going out for lunch, I think you can rock this fragrance. I really do. But I also think you can dress it down. If you're running your chores and you want something that's going to smell nice, Hugo Boss Magnetic, people, I'm telling you, is going to do the job. I think this is going to be very mass appealing. That is my thoughts on it. Not, com not complex at all, but very very nice it is fruity a little bit powdery a little bit vanillic you do get the maninka fruit but i don't know if it is the way the notes are blended together i don't know what else is in there but to me i'm getting a leathery nuance i really am and it is dusty it is a little powdery i like it i really really like it 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 does give off when I first sprayed it, straight away, it was giving off that Hugo Boss DNA, but only ever so slightly. But this fragrance is doing its own thing. It really, really is, people. And that is my thoughts on it. Obviously, I want to know if you've tried it. People, if you drop a comment down below, I always try and get back to you. I really do. Because I'm going to say it again. This channel's not about me. This channel's about us. This is about me trying to put you onto fragrances and us communicating. That is the way I see this channel growing. And that is how I am. So remember, smelling good's always a pleasure and never a chore. Drop a comment down below and let me know if you've tried this. Thank you for sticking with me and I will definitely see you on the next one. Cheers.